America. This, this is my first video. I've made it several times. I'm making it to document my weight loss um, journey. So I made notes. So I'm going to be looking down at my notes. Me and my husband got married and decided we want to have kids. I've been overweight my whole life, so, and I never expected to be small, but when we decided to start having children, and see, we started trying January, um, the end of January, beginning of February of 2015, with no success. Around the beginning of January this year, I had some issues. I went to see the doctor, and he told me I should consider having weight loss surgery. Initially, the only one I knew about was a gastric bypass. I did not want to do that. It works for some people. I know a lot of people that have had it. It's just not something I wanted done to me. So I told him no. I wanted to try my own some more. Went about that. Had little success. Someone told me about the gastric sleeve. Uh, I looked it up on YouTube and it was like a light bulb went off in my head. I knew I wanted it. I told my husband he didn't want me to have surgery. He was worried about me. And I told him that yes, there are risks of you know, complications and death, but I have, I already, I'm 23, and I already have mild hypertension, which runs in my family. I have a history of heart attacks and cancers and diabetes in my family on both sides. My odds aren't that good. I've, I've tried to lose weight and just not succeeded. I, he's finally, you know, he's supportive. He's on board with me. He, he's there. It's it's great. I called my insurance, and they said that they pay for it. I then um, called the doctor that said he would refer me if I ever decided I wanted to change my mind, and he got that rolling on his end. A few days later, I had an appointment with. A regular practitioner of a thyroid problem so I had to get that checked out again and I told her what was going on what I wanted to do um, I have a three month required supervised diet that I have to do and we started it that day which was the beginning of April of 2016 and I went to the one of May I got appointments set up to see the surgeon and the tr nutritionist and the psychologist, which the psychologist is required by my insurance too. So June, June 1st was when I saw the nutritionist and the surgeon's nurses. June 9th is when I saw met the surgeon. And June. 15th is when I met the psychologist. I passed that. That the 15th also. I brought home um, a sleep study equipment. The surgeon wanted me to have a sleep study done. It turned out that I do have mild sleep apnea, which I have to have a a machine for. I'm going to pick that up the 11th of July. Um, so. I have, I had my last supervised diet appointment July 6th. They submitted all the papers the 7th to the insurance company, so I'm waiting to make sure that all that's approved. If everything goes well, my surgery date should be July 25th of 2016. Today is July 10th and July 11th. I start my two two week uh, post op 
no, pre-op diet, <laughs> sorry, um, my two-week pre-op diet, liquid only, so, it's getting close, and pretty nervous and excited, and there's a lot of emotions going on up there, but I'm ready, um, I'll try to keep everybody updated that wants to watch this, thank you for your time, and maybe I'll see you next time. Thank you.